Hey, this is Drew Bennett from BenSpark.com, and uh, I just got home from work. Uh, I'm recording now early because there's supposed to be a snowstorm coming. Uh, I'm on the East Coast, so uh, we are right on the line of getting not too much to getting eight to whatever inches. So I have no idea what it's going to be when I wake up. Uh, so I figured I would get it done uh, now, record something. Uh, because if it's uh, after, um, if it's snowing like crazy when I wake up, I got a snow blow both my yard and our neighbors. So, and they have two driveways. So, um, they give me their snow blower. I do the, the driveway. So, um, really just helping them out. So, uh, you know, I don't mind, I don't mind doing it. I like, I like using the snow blower. It's a lot of fun. Um, you know, it's, it's freezing cold, but it, it's fun. So instead of, you know, just like, you know, what was going on today or maybe uh, a video here and there uh, of what happened throughout the day, I'm going to be asleep and maybe I'll insert whatever uh, snow we got here. All right, so it is, uh, it's snowing out here. It's about 4.30 or so. Uh, I'm in Massachusetts and uh, the snow is piled up. I've gone out and done some... Uh, Snow blowing. I do. I do my yard. I do the neighbors. Uh, a lot of the streets haven't been plowed yet. It's still not a lot of snow, but I got to work all night, so I had to go and get this done. Uh, you know, before I before I went. And uh, yeah, so that's getting the, some snow taken out. Um, and my neighbors, they've got uh, they got two driveways, so I got to do both uh, both of them. And uh, yeah, so this is what uh, this is what the neighborhood's looking like uh, right now with all that snow, and I hope wherever you are, you are keeping warm. The kids are out here helping. They're out playing. We aren't. <laughs> no, you're not. You're out playing. So what are you doing, Eva? We're collecting snow on my um, on my sled, and then we're gonna take it down here to make a big hill. Oh, okay. So you have a hill to sled, because we have lots of uh, high areas in the backyard here. Oh, you're making an artificial hill. Well, okay, Andrew. You're gonna sled down with this sled? Yeah. What's that? What's on that sled? Snow. Snow. What's this, what's what's on underneath the snow? What do you got there? Oh, a husky. Oh, sorry. The boss has spoken. The boss has spoken. So, I don't know. It could be a lot. It could be a little. Who knows? You saw the clip. Let's, uh, what's going on with that? I have no idea. But I also want to insert uh, another little video uh, right here. Oh, well, it looks like the team under Cap is actually going to soon be under Iron Man. At least the Iron Man monster truck in a moment as he crushes Team Cap. Yep, Team Stark has got all the toys. Yeah, I picked this up the other day. It is a new Hot Wheels monster truck, uh, the Iron Man monster truck. And then this was from a, a little I'll set of a whole bunch of little figures, uh, an unboxing I did a while back. I can link that in the show notes. But this is the Iron Man uh, monster truck. Really nice. I, they do have, uh, I'm told that they do have a uh, uh, Captain America one, but I didn't see it. I didn't see it anywhere. And, uh, of course, if I do see it, I'll probably buy it so that they can, you know, compete with each other. They do have uh, smaller versions of the monster trucks from Monster Jam, um, and I really would love it if uh, Hot Wheels and Monster Jam puts out the Civil War one, with Iron Man versus Captain America. I mean, how can you not? That'd be perfect. Now, I don't have the full-on team here for uh, Team Cap because, well, there's no uh, Winter Soldier car yet, and uh, there is no uh, Scarlet Witch uh, one yet. And uh, the thing is, I'm not sure when that Scarlet Witch one's going to come uh, because, as we know, you know, the toy companies do not put out a lot of female figures 
in cars as well. I mean, I've got Gamora from Guardians of the Galaxy, and I've got Black Widow. I actually got a couple Black Widow uh, cars. One is her themed car like this, and the other one is uh, more of a, you know, a car, and then she's on the package. But, uh, you know, let's get the Scarlet Witch one there. And um, you know, then we'll then we'll have some more. I'm I'm pretty sure that after uh, Captain America: Civil War, there's going to be a bunch more of these uh, type of cars out, which is going to be great because uh, I love collecting them. I get a whole bunch of them, and uh, this is just just a bit of my collection here. We got Cap, we got Falcon, Ant Man, and Hawkeye. And you can see they got some cool details on them. You know, the exhaust is actually a couple quivers. And uh, the front looks like a bow. Ant-Man shrunk down to his helmet size. And uh, Falcon. I'm not really a fan of Falcon's car. It It's alright. A lot of wings and stuff, but uh, I'm not a fan. But I do like Cap's car. And uh, I do, of course, I like Iron Man's much better. But, uh, you know, Iron Man's is cool because it fits into a Hulkbuster version as well. Uh, and that's a that's a cool car, and then of course, this monster truck is just the beast. And uh, as you can tell, I, you know, I was just playing a little tongue in cheek with the whole uh, a blogger civil war that I have going on with my buddy Andrew, who is on Team Cap, and I uh, am of course on Team Stark. And uh, so, this is Drew Bennett from BenSpark.com, and you can find me on Instagram as BenSpark, at Twitter as BenSpark at facebook.com slash I'm not a famous blogger and also you can subscribe here leave me a comment uh, leave me a thumbs up uh, answer my question of the day which today is uh, would you rather live in a place where you have all four seasons or where it's warm all the time you know are you going to enjoy the warmth or the uh, you know sunny weather or are you somebody who enjoys the snow and the cold uh, let me know in the comments below and uh, hope to see you tomorrow. Thank you.